pill testing rally is about to kick off at Sydney Town Hall and we're here because we want to see pill testing happen because we want to see lives saved. Premier Berejiklian, why won't you support pill testing? You say you have seen no evidence that it helps save lives or reduce risky drug taking, but there are experts lining up to show you this extremely sound data. Who is holding you to this zero tolerance, just say no to drugs position? How many more young people have to die before your conscience can't handle it? The New South Wales government maintains a strong support for drug detection dogs and those doggos find drugs successfully only in about 20% uh, of cases. I reckon I could manage that success rate at a festival myself. Um, in any case, the sight of law enforcement at the festival gates can encourage people to take all the drugs they have on them before they go in, which is obviously more dangerous. Now the Science Party's policy written a couple of years ago is to redirect funding from drug detection dogs to pill testing, but since then we've seen that public funding for pill testing probably isn't even necessary. We've seen a trial in Canberra and found that people want to provide the service and people want to use the service. So that's an interesting approach from a Liberal government to a free market solution. There's no justification for banning pill testing. If you disapprove of party drugs, it is the most pragmatic solution. Pill testing reduces drug use when people find out that their pills weren't what they expected. So unless you think the punishment for taking dodgy pills should be death, vote for your pro-pill testing candidates in the state election on March 23rd. That includes me, Andrea Leong for Heffron, and the James Jansen team for New South Wales in the Upper House.